Hey, what's up guys, Rev here. Today we're gonna be covering yet another round of Twitter discourse that is sure to rattle your brain cells. And I don't wanna waste any time, so let's get right into the tweet that started everything, which simply states, just a reminder with an attached image captioned, if you like this, you must also be okay with this. Man, Twitter users really have a passion for manufacturing people and opinions that don't exist to justify their insecurities, huh? And for the record, despite the censors, there's no actual nudity. The male and female characters are wearing what is essentially micro bikinis or something similar to that. And we're on YouTube, so you know how that goes. Advertisers can run stuff like this on here, but if I show a cleavage line on a two-dimensional character, Susan Waluigi will call in a drone strike on my location for not being advertiser friendly. But in all seriousness, this post is nearing 200,000 likes for creating drama that doesn't exist. If you like this, you must also be okay with this. Okay, sure. I'm confident in saying most people can agree with those terms. In fact, I've never seen more unity on Twitter than in the reply section of this tweet. Both men and women of all preferences are cool with the existence of both of these designs. And it's not like that male counterpart hasn't been done before. Has this user ever watched JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? Or how about some older examples like He-Man or a live action example like Conan the Barbarian? Franchises that were released in the 1980s and were widely praised even back then. Not only is this standard accepted by most, it's one that is often highly encouraged. In my entire experience on the internet, outside of deranged feminists, I have never heard a single complaint about a male character being too scantily clad. Not once. In fact, this reworking of the meme is a much more accurate representation of any problems stemming from this outfit design drama. But yeah, this post is not the controversial hot take it hopes to be, it's one that most people actually support. If anything, this format makes for a great template for people to design their original characters after, both male and female, much to the enjoyment of all viewers. But that's gonna do it for this video, hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.